So this is another one of my rant videos where I get to rant. I wasn't actually sure if I should even do a video on this, but I figured, what the hell. So yesterday, March 20th, was the Persian New Year. And I'm not going to get into the Persian New Year. Most people are not going to care. So I'm not going to tell you about it. If you're interested in learning about it, then you can Google it on your own. But the Persian New Year, the one thing I want to stress is that it is not a religious holiday, It's a, which is what I like about it. It's a secular holiday. So the problem with the Persian New Year is that no one really knows about it in the U.S. My issue with that has to do with, you know, I've thought about this from time to time. And I was going to get a lot more specific in this video, but I decided it's actually probably not necessary to do that. So various holidays of either different religions or not even religions, but even cultures have a lot of world recognition as well as recognition in this country. Everyone seems to know when there is either a parade going on from this particular nation or there's a holiday from that's you know from this culture or that culture or this religion or that faith, etc. And no one really knows about the Persian New Year, which happens to coincide every year with um, the beginning of spring. The other reason why I wasn't sure if I should make this video is because I usually am not very um, I don't have a sense of nationalism per se. So yet at the same time, you know, the thing is that one of the things with Persians is that Persians, for some bizarre reason, feel as though modesty is a virtue. And it's actually not. On an individual level, whether you want to be modest or not, that's on an individual level, right? But on a, you know, collective level, modesty gets you nowhere and nothing at all. It really doesn't. Modesty is just akin to no one even knowing that you exist, to be very honest about that. So I guess maybe the point of this rant, and I'm not even sure if this one has a point, it might be a pointless point, is that... And I hope that, you know, Persian Jews also celebrate the Persian New Year because, again, it's not a religious holiday. It's a secular holiday. The Persian Jews that I've known throughout the years, for some reason, I've always forgot to ask them. But I guess what I'm really trying to say is, you know, shame on this whole concept of modesty that Persians have for whatever bizarre reason and this sort of cultural trait of modesty. It gets you nowhere and it gets you nothing. So send me your comments and questions, and each week you'll get a chance to win a copy of one of my books, your choice, either my book on presentation skills or business writing skills.